But they always buy something. Because they see something well, unique, original. I don't make any, anything more than one time. I come to Westmore in 1977, December. Two of uh, two weeks. And when I saw the place, it's been, it come like somewhere that I was dreaming about. So I decided to settle down here. My mother, she didn't like that. Because she didn't want to lay down. Same catching. I was in my own here. Same catching. Basic art, Kingston. You know? All right. But from seven years old, I could find myself. I could draw. You know. What kind and of things you used to love to? What yeah, type like of things you used to? Flowers and little stuff like that when you're young. Mm -hmm. And then uh, after going to school, now I find out say I have this talent to draw. I have to draw for my teachers. Then, at my class. So when you come down here now, there was some hippies down here, you know, and they was protesting against the Vietnam War. So. You don't know they come like they're the white rasters, you know. So they come here and live in Belmont, spend all the day in Belmont. So move along with them, and they, they like the artwork, and you know. So I start to support them with some artwork when they want them. But I taught myself to carve. Uh, I couldn't carve. So I'm self taught carve, good carve. I like carving, so I decided to do it myself. So I try it, but it's not easy. But after a while, it comes in. So I think it's hard when you say it's hard. Okay. I can only have a problem when you see our problem. But every problem can be solved some real time. Anyway, yeah, I've been here working till it begins to grow so much that one of the time that I try to look for apprentice. But when I, I try to train the apprentice, as they learn and they can make some money, they go away. Well, I couldn't be, that wasn't bad for me because they go get a job. You know? Some go uh, overseas and some go nigger and all that. Well, I used to be in Negril too. Negril, I don't like town places. You like yeah, the yeah. I like the cool, cool vibe, so I can find real art in me. Because my art, they come from inside. Most people do not know that if you don't go within, you shall go without. Yeah, because they always teach I that be careful what I set my mind upon, because I shall surely act. And that's true. Because when I was young, I said, I realized that I was a Piscean. When I read about that, they would say, I'm artistic. You know, mm -hmm. so I said then, I didn't like what they draw black people at the time. You know, they try them looking like monkeys and downgrade the black, you know, and like everything. And I say, I wait. when I come, I'm gonna show them all black people still. Okay. So I'm gonna do black art when I come. Check the Jamaican art, you know. So I said here, and then about 20 years ago, I have a shop right over there. And some guys vandalize it you know, and, and burn it down. So, it was not a, a small journey, but it was like mine over matter, you know? Yeah. So, I knew that I could manage without even outside help. It was difficult. You know? So, I go on and go on and try to save some money and do all kind of things to get it done. It didn't work that way. But one day, uh, one of my brethren from Sad, I don't remember his name right now. But he look after the boat for the food for the poor. And he tell me, Joe Carlo, if I had known that your shop was burned down, you would get a brand new shop. But that was a little bit too late. He said, I was trying to see what he could do. But anyway, tribe tours, they had a, a, a session run by Bluefield Center, where I was at a foundation, you know? Because it started there and then we get a grant. So we could get to develop this little shop here. So I don't really get no not help from more than from the work that I do and from some of my good friends. But I love art so much that I dream art, I sleep art, I eat art, I, you know. So art is everything to yeah, you. Yeah, to me. Yeah, because it's expression of, from, from a culture. The type of business that you have, what are persons saying about your, your style of... Yeah, they, they, they like it a lot. Because it's, it's, it's kind of original, you know. If you notice my art, bro, they are all... The name of the place is Tudor Black. Because they say I shouldn't give it that name because it's like a racist thing. I say no, black am I? Proud am I to be black? But I'm not proud like being, you know, exalted to myself. If you look up there, it's just time of I'm a Rasta lion without any pride, you know. Mm -hmm. Pride comes before destruction, so I don't need pride, you know. I know these are respect and principles. Those are most of the things that, and morality too. I, yeah, I teach youth from the university. They come and spend like two weeks in the community. And I give them some lecture on Rasta culture and 
how to make their life better and even hard to. Yeah, this is Irby by Yakaro, and Tim Jakaro, you know. <laughs> I'm a plant, my name is Irby. I was made by Ya, which is Ja, or Yahweh. I am not a jug. They call me nicknames I don't really care for, like dangerous, bad, ganja, pot, grass, tampi, skunk, weed, curly, sensi, marijuana, and a lot of other names I can't even remember. They say I am most wanted, and that I was made for the use of man. Yet they fight me and hate me and say I am illegal. Why? Many use me and abuse me and say, and yet they can't do without me. They say all kinds of things about me. I don't steal or kill, so let me be free. I am just a plant. Herbie, the one love. I made that one to the first. So you're not only an artist? No, mommy, tell me, tell me, tell me, I'm a student, I'm a teach man. <laughs> I come from foreign man. Yeah, man. Some of them don't talk to me because you changed my life instantly. Because I tell them how things happen. Respect. The mind, you know, you see the mind. All the creating force, it can build you up and it can destroy you. So you have to be careful where you set your mind upon. And we put that in the youth, even my look on them. That's very important to the world, if you know that. Your mind. That's why so much things are going to Jamaica, you know. What are the mind come from? 